What are the biggest signs that people miss of an uncomfortable dog? A dog that's getting really uncomfortable and could nip or potentially bite? Well, side eyeing and growling probably would be the would be the one that's immediate immediate to, to, to snapping. So they will freeze and maybe look forward, but look at you through out of the side of their eyes. Now the sometimes if the tail if the tail can either be down or it can be up. So if the tail is really up on their back, you really have a problem at that point if the dog is freezing and side eyeing. You really have a problem. The the thing to do is really move away, not fast, but nice and gently and try to fuse the situation. If the tail is down between the legs, it could you could the could be dog could be very nervous and and fear bite at that point. But the same the same sign will be there. I've I've seen dogs here really with their tail up on their back doing that particular behaviour and I know right away at that point the thing to do is try to diffuse the situation, move away from the dog if possible. Don't give the dog eye contact. So I mean if a dog is in this situation the real wrong thing to do is to stare at the dog. If you stare at a dog in that situation, what you're really doing is you're putting a hook to the dog. Dogs don't if if dogs don't stare at each other, it's it's really rude in dog terms to stare at each other. So if you're staring at a dog, you're you're sort of being you're being overtly aggressive. The dog well the dog perceives you're being overtly aggressive. Like uh, our puppies out there even like what are the thirteen weeks old now? If you go out and you actually stare at them, they'll roll over on their back and they'll pee very submissively because they're terrified when you stare at them. Dogs don't meet eye to eye. If dogs are meeting eye to eye, they're confrontational. So, I mean, if a dog is in this situation, he's growling, side-eyeing, this type of thing, wrong thing to do is to stare. You need to move. Think of your energy. You need to move, not squeal or shout. You need to move quite gently and slowly and remove yourself from the danger area. Yes, that's the most surprising thing that I discovered when I got my dog. Dogs don't like eye contact. It's not a good way to greet them. They can perceive it as being a bit aggressive and they generally don't like it. Yeah, well, I see. I, I my, my interpretation would be they, they see it as rude, rude and confrontational. I wouldn't even, you could say aggressive, but I would say they see it as rude and confrontational. So um, some dogs will will be okay with it very we'll say very confident dogs but nervous dogs will not be okay with it i mean the, the majority of dogs that come to us that people say are aggressive i would say up to 90 percent of the dogs that come to us that people say are aggressive are dogs that are insecure and afraid and the people are not picking up on this and they're putting the dogs in very uncomfortable positions and then the dog is reacting by growling or snapping or nipping and then the people are saying oh the dog is aggressive but I would say in all the years that I'm doing this maybe I've seen one or two dogs that I could classify as really aggressive whereas dogs that I would see generally that people would tell me are aggressive are dogs that are afraid 